We set up our slides on a piece of paper first, and then we try to make a seal curl on this slide, just as big as we want. And then we have to make sure that we turn the slide over, because we want to put the smear on the other slide, not on the same time we put the seal curl on. And then we put a little bit of water on the other slide. And then we try to um, heat the loop for just a few seconds and try to cool it down. As you see in the video, it's cooled down already. And then now we just take a little bit of water and drop it into the slide. Very smooth. And then again, we have to hit the loop and let it cool down for just a minute or less than a minute. And then we just take a little bit of the cloning of the organism, just a little bit. And then try to slide it all over the slide, I mean all over the circle we made. And very smooth. And we just let it to sit for 5 to 6 minutes to let the slide dry. Now the slide has been dried. We attach the clip into it and we will go for the heat fix. Just a few seconds, not too much. And then we just touch the slide to make sure it's hot enough. The first dye we use is the crystal violet. We just add a few drops of, of it into the slide. Now we let it sit for just one minute, not more than one minute, not less. Mm. After a minute, we will wash off the slide. We will wash off all the dye from the slide. Just to make the slide clear, we try to wash the both sides of the slide. Just we want to make sure we take the dye off. And then after that we use the second dye, which is the other dye. We add a few drop on the slide and let it sit the same amount of time for the crystal violet, just one minute. After one minute, we wash off the iodine from slide. Make sure it's clear and there is no dye left on the slide. And then we add the depolarizer just for 10 seconds, not more than that, because it will wash off the dye. Just 10 seconds. And after that, we will rinse it with water. Try to do it from the both side. Clearly. And then we add the last dye, which is called safranin. This is the same amount of other dyes, just a few drops on the slide. And then we let, we let it sit again for one minute. After one minute, we will rinse it. We rinse the slide. This time we, will, we want to make sure there is no more dye left on the slide. We will wash it clearly. And then we use the bubbleless paper to dry it up completely. We detach the clipper. And then we put the slide on the paper. We fold it and we gently tap. very smooth and gently. And this slide is ready now to put it under the microscope. Make sure the slide is dried enough. Thank you for listening and watching us.